the average cost of a filler in the United States or everywhere you go, anywhere you go in the U.S., let's say uh, on an average it would be about 500, whether you get, you know, Restylane, uh, Juvederm, or whatever it is. So to put in 50 cc's of that, it will cost you about $25,000 worth of fillers, which is a huge amount. And most people will be able to afford to put in maybe one syringe, two syringes, three syringes, but then they cannot do this every six months because it, it, the cost is prohibitive. However, if you do the fat transfer, the initial cost may be a little bit higher, but on the long run, this is much better. And these fillers that you use, they only last about six months, but these fat cells it stays with you for the rest of your life. Now, is this a only one time procedure? No, I mean, this is, for the most part, most people are happy with it, but then maybe in two to three years, they may want to do a little touch up. But the amount of fat you put in the second time, probably a lot less than when you do in the first time. It will be just a little touch up. And it, it's good to keep up with it if you do a second procedure, maybe in a couple of years, and then maybe in five, six years where the aging of the skin takes place again, then you may want to do touch up again. And the advantage of that is because not only you're getting fat cells, but you're also getting the stem cells. And this really is the most important part of this whole thing, because the stem cells is the one that causes thickening of the skin, stimulation of the collagen, and all the growth factors that goes with the stem cells. It really rejuvenates your face. And if you look at somebody who had fillers and somebody that has fat transfer, you can see a certain glow in the face you will not see with the fillers.